All my friends were shocked. I've never really been much of a pet person. Your birthday, buddy. They loved the fact that I got a rabbit out of nowhere. I always thought, do they really mean that much? You know, because it's just, just an animal. I love his tail and I love his little belly. I'm losing all my street cred. The chief loves just sitting there getting head rubs. If you're rubbing him in the wrong spot, like on his cheeks, and he wants a head rub, then he'll push his head into your hand. It's nice after being at work for the day. Yeah, if you just sat on the sofa, just, he'll just jump up, have a little sniff in your face, and then, um, yeah, have a little light down next to you. Yeah, it's lovely when they, they just sit next to you and just let it yeah, get straight. Super Mom by accident, really. She was going away, and my girl said, "Oh, do you mind having having him for a couple of weeks?" I was like, "Yeah, cool." I said, "But you know, it's only a couple of weeks." Carol Brett. This is a surprise, but you know, we uh, we bonded. I didn't expect it. I've never had a rabbit or anything before, and uh, but he just he just come into my life, I guess. And he was yeah, my little buddy. Love, love breakfast time. We, we normally have Rice Krispies together. How you doing? He was just really lethargic. Took him, took him straight to the vets because he just wasn't right, wasn't really moving. He's horrible. And I never really, I never really uh, thought that, you know, I'd be that worried of an animal. It, it was really sad. I was like, do you know what, I can get my, my lounge back, I can have my carpet free from having holes in it. But then after, after a few weeks, I thought, you know, it, it was lovely to have him around. Yeah, I thought, uh, I'll just have a little look, see if there's any other little rascals available. And then I uh, found the chief. He was living uh, in an old people's home and um, put him in a, a shed just out the back. And uh, they, just, they just wanted rid of him, basically. He, he come to me, we had a little, uh, had a little sniff and the thing. Well, I can't leave him there. He looked too sad out there. He was a little bit, a little bit nervous at first. Took a, took a few days, but you know, not long to start becoming uh, the owner of the home or the boss. Don't growl at me when I'm picking up your poop. He's got free reign of the house when he's when he's not being a rascal. That is. Fair enough, dude, buddy. You back here, Tommy? The chief likes exploring, so if, if I leave the door open, I'm having a bath or a shower. Yeah, he'll pop in. He likes TV programs, so like sport, I think, because he sees the grass. I think maybe that's it. Spin. Good boy. I, I, I genuinely didn't, didn't realise that they'd have, have little personalities. That shocked me. I just thought they were kind of just an animal that you'd have in a back, back garden. Um, but then experiencing both of them come and live with me, it's changed me. See you later, bud.